Hello and welcome to Weird Magazine's first video investigation of cyber culture. I'm Martin Poulter and today I'm looking at the often disturbing phenomenon of work-related materials appearing on porn websites. To many of us, the idea of working in an office sounds like something that would only appeal to a deviant minority. However, statistics show that a majority of British adults, both single and in relationships, use office work to satisfy their need for earnings. Your next door neighbours could be office workers. Someone you chat to on the bus could be minutes later working in an office and you'd never know. Even the man in the pub who sells you porn DVDs could be the sort of man who enjoys a day job. How does this affect you or I? Well, increasingly, the materials used by these individuals are appearing on pornographic websites. How do I know? It happened to me. It happened here, where I was hot-desking at a colleague's computer. I had a deadline coming up. I had just five minutes to get myself off before the bloke came back. It should have been a simple matter, but while I was surfing for jugs, I had the misfortune to click on a .doc file. And that gave me what we have here. Now, obviously, we're not allowed to show this to you, but it's an example of what's called meeting minutes. It describes a meeting involving perhaps up to a dozen individuals, men and women, and it describes in detail action points that they would be expected to do, either alone or with each other. I found exposure to this material very distressing, and ever since this experience I found it very difficult to grease up my bulging knob. It's hard to trace the perpetrators in these cases, but there may be a technological solution. There is now a piece of software called WorkSafe, and this can filter out work-related content to stop it appearing in your web browser. I'm using now one of the sites which has WorkSafe enabled. Um, it's sergeantspanky.com, and what we seem to have here are JPEGs of women being spanked. And then on the next page, more Spanking, yeah. and then spanking, more, more, spanking, more. Well, as you can see, my web browsing experience is now... Oh, hang on. Oh, God! Management consultancy! Oh, God! I... Obviously, we can't show you this, but I seem to have here a, a picture of a man consulting another man. I'm sorry for using the C word like that, but I was not expecting to see his suit and tie right in my face like that. I thought I knew about this stuff, I knew here about this thing, but when you see it, God! Well, it didn't end there, unfortunately. I shut down my browser, cleared my cache, and rebooted the computer, but since then I've found that the site installed this piece of unwanted software. It's what computer experts call a PowerPoint presentation. And really, if you're the sort of person who spreads this kind of stuff on the internet, have you no shame? Why don't you just leave me alone to toss myself off while slapping my balls?